podcasting from my basement where my washing machine and dryer are. And the background noise is my furnace. Sorry, I don't want to turn it off. It's freezing. It's January. Um, so it's January 2018 when I'm doing this. And the reason why I'm down here is because I'm doing a review of the OXO Good Grips Fur Lifter Pet Hair Remover. So it comes, there's three versions of it. There's a, a travel one, this one, and then one for furniture. And this one is for clothing specifically, but they're all very much similar in design. Looks like this. It has an arrow pointing in the direction that you want to swipe the tool to get the hair off. And then once the hair is removed from the clothing, you put it back into the container and then that gets rid of the hair that's on it so that you have a clean slate again. So in other words, it's unlike those uh, sticky rollers where you have to constantly get new sticky rollers. So it's better for the environment, better for your pocketbook. Um, currently it is $14.95 on Amazon and there's actually some sort of like as seen on TV brush that's very very similar to this in appearance. I would guess it's probably darn near the same product. It's blue um, and seems to work very similarly. So I'm going to show you how it removes fur from this fleece top that I have. It's probably the best thing it's removed fur from. Um, it also has done a great job at removing fur from my pants. These pants in particular, um, I usually wear them and then remove them, remove the hair from them. So without further ado, let's get started. At first you just remove the fur lifter from the container and then you'll see that I have various amounts of cat hair on this. It's not picking up. When it stops picking up hair as well, I just put it back in the thing to get the hair off. And then you can also flip it over on the other side. Just make sure that you're always going in the direction of that arrow. Because if you don't, then it actually just removes the hair on back onto the top that you're trying to get it off of. And you see all those little like bald areas underneath the armpit? Sometimes it will remove those. Sometimes, okay. You have to kind of work at it or even pick them off. Okay, now for this sleeve. And then on the, um, the hood right here, it, ha it comes with this handle. I think the handle's worthless. Um, I'm always holding it right here on the sides to get the hair off. Flip this over. Uh oh, I used the wrong. Wrong direction. You can feel it too, the direction that you go incorrectly on. Okay, so then you put it back in there to remove it out and then just to remove the hair and the lint that you've removed from your top, you just take off this bottom piece and then all the hair and lint comes out from under here and then you can obviously throw that away or whatever. And then you just start the process over. So I try to finish, or I try to do obviously the whole top. We bought this in June, or I bought this in June, um, based off of a reader's. A, a reader contacted me, um, Deidre, and said, "Listen, I love, love, love this new pet hair remover. I like it more than the Lily brush, which is uh, another pet hair remover that we." like a lot and so I said okay I'll see if I can get one from OXO see if they'll send me one for a review um, I didn't get a response from them and didn't hear back so when I had enough gift cards from all of my swag bucks endeavors I um, went ahead and purchased one for me and one for my sister my sister hasn't really used it she's 
more inclined to use the um, the sticky pad things or the sticky roller things, which I don't really care for at all. I actually really detest those things. Um, so I started using it more regularly on different items and found that it works best on fleece and best on my the pants that I'm wearing now. I really don't. Um, Sorry, I just got too much hair on it to remove more hair. I really don't like it for furniture. I still absolutely prefer my Lily brush for furniture and for taking hair off of pet beds and all that kind of stuff. Like in, including that cat power tower we have that's covered with um, with a, a carpet. And so I'll use the Lily brush to get off the majority of the hair and then I'll um, vacuum the rest of it. So I do think you need different tools for different fabrics um, and this one is just freaking awesome for the fleece top that I like to wear a lot. So it's super warm and I don't go around not picking up my cats so cat hair removal is an essential item for me and always has been since I had a cat. My mom gave me a sign to put on my bulletin board when I was in high school that said no outfit is complete without cat hair because my my parents really don't like cat hair and um, I didn't ever mind it being on me so it was like the the running joke in the family. Okay and just to show you really quickly how I approach my pants again I'm always holding it on the side there I never use this because it's wobbly. I've got another video of my mom removing the same um, the cat hair from this top that I'll show you how how holding the handle there doesn't really work. I don't know who designed that part. Anyway, um, this is how I go about it on my pants. Oops. And you can't see, but I just have loose cat hairs, you know, kind of like the ones that are like floating in the air on my pants. So um, I tend to leave this in my kitchen and then I do it right bef before I leave the house so that um, it is, my pants are hair free when I leave. <laughs> and then just to remove it, put it back in there and it's ready to go for the next time. All right guys, thanks so much for watching. This is one of the culprits as to why we need products like this. So thank you for ever who and for whoever invented it and uh, let me know what cat hair removal products you like like what are your suggestions your tips etc these pants for example I do not even I leave them in the basement I take them out of the dryer or I take them off of my drying rack and leave them in the basement until I put them on because it helps with the cat hair situation um, whereas other clothing like t-shirts and stuff I fold and bring upstairs and they have it has more contact with Charlie. Wanna say bye? Wanna say bye, 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 bye. Bye guys, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Helps our channel grow and helps me bring you more reviews like this one. I must though, what's she do with me? She gonna put me up on nails. I'm gonna get up on there. I just removed all the cat hair from there, but you can get back up on nails.